What's good, planet Earth? Welcome back to the channel that brings you the content that you request every day. My name's Charlie, and today I'm back with another reaction. I've been very excited about this. So obviously it was just the Grammys, and Bruno Mars and Anderson Pack did a performance of their new single, Leave the Door Open. I'm not wearing my coat. Ah, oh, man, I just realised. I've got a fluffy, fake fur coat that I usually wear when I'm listening to these guys. Should I go and get it? I don't even know where it is. I should get it really, shouldn't I? Hang on. Good. Now I'm feeling fly. We can carry on. <laughs> this coat's ridiculous. Oh, I'm worn out now. Oh, I need to uh, get my fitness up. Anyway, um, what was I going to say? Yeah, so... Go and follow me on my social media, guys, if you haven't already. Uh, they're down in the description. I've got my Twitter on there. Instagram's a real fun place to be. You get better insight into my music. Um, I reply to my DMs, stuff like that. So, uh, yeah, go over there and check them out. Um, Patreon as well, uh, where you'll get all of the videos that go onto YouTube 48 hours before they go on there. You'll also get... God, I'm absolutely knackered. Uh, <laughs> that's appalling, isn't it? Um You'll also get uh, exclusive content that doesn't go onto YouTube, more insights about my life. You'll also get all of the block content from YouTube, of which there's a lot. And you'll also get a lot of other fun stuff like weekend Q&As, stuff like that. It's a fun place to be. It's very reasonable, so go and check it out. Anyway, without further ado, let's go. They're so polished. I mean, this is this is live, man. And they're it's almost better than the studio recording. It's astonishingly good. Man. I love the setup that they've got as well. Like they're they're both as equally the front man as the other one. So, you know, when one of them's got their part, the other one goes and joins the back and singers move in, you know, and then uh, and then they switch it up again. It's wicked. But they're both just like, you can tell they're in their bag at the moment. It's it's sick. It's so sick. Like, ah, oh man. Like, I feel like... And do you know what was what was great as well about the Grammys last night? And I'll react to more than just this from, from the Grammys. Man, it's just like, it feels like a bit of a dream come true. Because the best musicians are finally getting their flowers and getting the recognition that they deserve and like amazing music is happening and it's like it's not even in the background anymore it's like you got these guys her 
her. I, uh, I love her. And, you know, she won Grammy last night. Um, Jasmine Sullivan, I mean, she, she didn't win a Grammy. Jacob Collier, he's getting his flowers, man. Again, <laughs> five times Grammy winner now. And he is just sick. There's so much great music out there at the moment. Man, we're so lucky. I say this all the time, but like, just gratitude, man. I've been in such, such a state of despair about music for such a long time. And this just like, you, you know, I, I think for a long time in many respects, we felt like a lot of things in the world are just sort of doing this getting worse and worse and worse and worse and everything's just like you know all the <clears throat> all the candy that you like and all the chocolate bars you like are getting smaller and smaller and smaller and they bullshit you like um oh yeah it's for health reasons it's like no the hell it's not you're just giving us less and charging us the same it's just stuff like it <laughs> seems like a silly example but just stuff like that just always getting less and less and less and things get worse and worse and worse quality and music for a long time was just getting worse and worse and worse. And as someone who loves music and loves good music and proper artistry, this was, it feels like, it, it feels like a dream. It feels like a dream come true. Like the, a day that I dreamt of. Maybe it's because I'm getting old. <laughs> <laughs> and if maybe it's because I'm getting older and everyone who starts getting a bit older and heading toward middle age starts sort of being nostalgic and wishing for things that um remind them of their their youth and this is obviously I wasn't born in the 70s but I mean 70s was kind of music that I grew up on when I was really young and uh this is so badass it's so sick oh, we don't deserve it actually we do deserve it we do deserve it we fully deserve it <laughs> <laughs> 
That was so epic. Imagine it. Oh, the only thing that would have made that better is if it was in front of an actual crowd. You know me, I love some crowds. I just feed off the energy and I'm sure they would have done too. Oh my God, they nailed it. They absolutely nailed it. I love them. I cannot wait for this album. We need more. I need more. Ah. Anyway, let me know what you thought. I'm in heaven right now. I'm in absolute heaven. I cannot believe we're getting this. Not only are we getting some of the best music. Sorry, I'm no one gushing. I do this all the time. But I care so deeply about it. Like, not only are we getting the best music, but they're getting the recognition for it as well. And, they, you know, they're going into the main, it's going into the mainstream. Yes. 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 Thank you. Thank you, God. Thank you, artists. Thank you. Thank you. I'm so pumped, man. I'm so pumped. I'm like, I'm like excited and verging on emotional as well. I'm so pumped, man. So pumped. Yes. Anyway, Wait. let me know. <laughs> I can barely say what I need to say. Let me know what you thought in the comments, guys. I hope you loved that as much as I did. Um, uh, what else? What else do I say at the end of the video? Let me know what you thought in the comments. Smash the like button. <laughs> smash the like. Sorry, I'm I'm in pieces. Um, smash the like button. It helps to promote the video on YouTube. And um, yeah, as always, be kind to yourselves. Love everyone and take care. Freaking love you guys.